Hey guys, it's Minty and welcome back to another tutorial. This time I'm gonna be talking about the white texture glitch. If you don't know what that is, I mean it's pretty self-explanatory. You upload a model to NMD, but its textures are gone and it appears to be white. And so today I'm gonna be talking about what kind of issues could be causing these um, this glitch and how to solve it. Now just a quick disclaimer since I barely ever get this glitch then I most likely will not be covering every single issue that could cause that glitch. Um, pretty much speaking from my own experiences and knowledge so if this video is not helpful to you, I'm sorry. I'm just speaking from my own experiences with this white texture glitch. Now that that's out of the way, let's uh, move on to the tutorial. I could come up with like four reasons why this glitch could happen and, and also the solutions for that. So the first reason why this white glitch could happen is because you wrote the name of the texture incorrectly in the texture box. So uh, let's see. So for example this skirt texture. The texture of the skirt is mic underscore S and has a file type PNG. And so this this model part, but you can see the S is missing, so you just have to write the name correctly. So yeah, just write the name correctly and the texture will appear. If you're one hundred percent sure that you wrote the name of the texture correctly in the texture box, make sure you also put the correct file type in the texture box. So for example, her shirt. These parts are all actually PN, PNG types, but if you open this and you see that it's BMP, change it to PNG. And there you go. I sincerely apologize for any of the noise that my microphone may pick up. I don't know if it's gonna, but it's annoying me to death. Anyways, let's go back to the tutorial. If you're 100% sure that the name of the texture and the file type of the texture are written correctly in the texture box, but the texture still appears white, then make sure that it's in the same folder as your model. If the texture is in a subfolder, which means that, that it's in a folder in the folder of the model, like here, then what you have to do is, uh, let me find this, okay, how many of them are, okay, so you have to, um, well I selected multiple of the parts in the material tab because they all have that exact texture, but if it's just one thing then just select that one thing. And what you want to do now is write the name of the folder that's in your model folder. So the name of the sub folder, which in my case is text, then write slash and then the name of the texture that's in the sub folder. And so when you click off, the texture appears. So these were the most common issues with the white textures. However, there can also be some issues that are not so common. In fact, I had that once like a month ago or something. And I was actually very confused because that usually never happens to me. Anyways, um, 
I didn't prepare it in this video, most likely because I failed to fuck my model up with that. I'm not sure how, but apparently I can't ruin my models. Anyways, <clears throat> the idea behind it is that PMX editor is a little bit picky. What I mean by that is it wants everything to be perfect. It doesn't want any duplicate names, it wants the correct names of textures, it doesn't want any extra bones, physics, joints, nothing extra. So another thing that can cause the white model glitch is if you for example have uh, like something here in the sphere box let's say well right now it's a skin uh, underscore as BMB but let's write something well totally random something that doesn't exist in this folder let's say well I don't know one dot BMP and uh, I don't remember what setting it had here in my model I don't remember if it was multi-sphere or add sphere either way it should be either this or that or maybe subtext I don't know I w I'm not sure I don't remember what it was but basically I'm not gonna save the model because my laptop absolutely hates it when I when I'm recording and using MMD at the same time so I'm just gonna explain it in the in the PMX editor so let's say you have some kind of weird sphere file in the sphere box and um, you should either delete the name of the sphere or change it to something that would suit the model better or change the setting like for example if it's multi-sphere change it to add sphere or vice versa it doesn't matter but just don't keep unnecessary texture names in the sphere box perhaps also in the texture box here I don't know if the that also causes the white model glitch but what caused my model to appear white was the sphere here and same also I guess with the tunes so yeah PMX is very picky but if you still have issues with the white textures like you have the texture in the same folder as the model you write the name correctly you put the correct file type and the model sti still appears white then I suggest you just click on file PMX info and then you don't have to be a master in Japanese or just know Japanese at all actually because you mostly can get the idea of what it's trying to say if you put it in Google Translate just uh, select this and copy and paste put in Google Translate it of course it does not translate it perfectly because well it's Google Translate after all but you can get the basic idea what it's trying to say so every field that says bad just copy this text paste it to Google Translate try to get the basic idea of what it's trying to say it, do it does not always work I know it does not always work but most of the time it does so just if it says like duplicate names just rename the parts or bones or whatever it is if it has some extra physics delete them and if it's some kind of issue that cannot solve and it's for example something that has to do with the vertex tab just leave it out as I always do most of the time it doesn't affect it that much I think at least for me it doesn't most of the time it just has to do with the oh no not the vertex face one <laughs> I'm sorry or it could be vertex whatever but basically these two tabs I don't know what how to fix problems in these but basically the material bone and so so on until the soft body excluding that most of the time it could be something that from these tabs here that could be causing the white model glitch if it's not 
related to the textures. So, I hope that was helpful. If it wasn't, I'm sorry. I'm just speaking from my own experiences. I don't know every single thing what could cause the white model glitch. I barely get them. Like I said, most of the times that I got that glitch was because either I put the wrong type of file in the texture box or I mistyped the name of the texture and also that little unique thing with the sphere texture box. Other than that, I barely ever get the glitch so if it wasn't helpful, I'm sorry. That's the best I could explain it to you, give solutions to you. But yeah, the PMX info window here is your best friend when you're making models pretty much. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it was helpful. Hope you have a nice day and I see you in my next video, whatever I make, whenever I make. And um Bye!